Why you still looking at me? Why What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are gonna do top 10 songs of 2018, my choice. So, give them a round of applause. You guys made it. This is my top 10 list. Let's begin. Number 10 is Bay Herself, Dua Lipa and Calvin Harris, One Kiss. Um, yeah, I don't know why I like the song. I'm not gonna lie, I actually didn't like it in the beginning, but then like, when Mr. Harold O'Kane decided he likes it, I thought, why not, give it a go. So. Dua, Calvin Harris, number 10. The crowd, baby, it's a no-brainer. It ain't the hard it shoes. Him and me be for real, baby, it's a no-brainer. Well, guys, so for me, number 9 for 2018 was No-Brainer, DJ Khaled, Justin Bieber, Quavo, and Charge the Rapper. Um, I just thought it was a cool song. It, I was a bit disappointed, though, that it wasn't higher up. I mean, I'm the one I love that song. It was okay, but I'll take it. I just, I only have this because everyone makes fun of me saying so like Justin Bieber. But this is a pretty sick thing. I got it for my birthday. <laughs> it's pretty cool. So shout out to whoever got this. Thanks, guys. Um, yeah. Oh, Drizzy Drake takes number eight spot with God's plan. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I couldn't go anywhere within the first three months of the year without hearing God's plan play. And every single boy, man, whatever, having I only love my bed and my mama. So let's move on. It was a dope song, but eight. Next song. Kiki, do you love me? Are you riding? Say you never ever leave from beside me. I actually enjoyed the song before it became a meme. <laughs> So when it became a meme, I was like, oh, okay, this is pretty cool. And Will Smith did a cool challenge. And then everybody decided they're gonna do the In My Phoenix challenge. I didn't do it because I couldn't care less. So that was my little rendition of it. So Drake again with spot number seven. It's a sixth song, I enjoyed it. But yeah, nothing much I can say about it. You know how it goes. Let's move on. Camilla Bay, number six. Six, where are we on six? Number six with Havana. Woo. Um, only, only the version with Young Thug in it. Because without Young Thug, I don't actually like the song. <laughs> Literally, Young Thug takes us from 10 to number 6. So, shout out Young Thug, you legend. Um, no, I just like the song. I don't know why. It's a mellow song. It's just like everybody enjoyed it, so it has to be up there. So, yeah, number 6. Top five time. Just wanna kick it, Jackie Chan. Coming in at number five is the man, the legend himself, Mr. Post Malone. That, ooh, um, coming in with Jackie Chan for a sick song with Anna Tiesto. But I love the song. Like at first I heard I was like Jackie Chan's gonna be trash. But it was pretty sick. So I was like, yeah. Shout out Post, well done. Coming at number four is another Posty song with Mr. Sway Lee or Sway Lee featuring Post. I don't know, they're kind of half half. But um, Sunflower, it just came out for the new Spider Man movie. Um, I really think it's a cool, mellow song. Like, it's a, the beat is different, which I enjoy. But um, yeah, sixth song, take number four. Top three time. Woo! Coming at number three is a person who I really did not expect to be on this list. Mr. Tiger with Taste. Why you claim Ooh. that you rich? That's a false claim. Um, I'll be straight to the yeah, web. No I really think that's train. a sick Cold song. I really enjoyed it. I'm not gonna lie. Every morning, I have to walk to class with this drop. Pop them in the like earphones, and I was out. Oh, it was such a sick picks, song. I'm, I'm still playing it. Like when I'm sitting at the pool, I'm, I'm playing Taste. Don't absolutely crack. Um, it could have been high on my list, but the, the top three were very close. Actually, no, top two. Three and two were close, but. Let's move on to number two. Number two is once again, the guy who had the most seats in my top 10 list, Post Malone and my man, Ty Dolla Sign. Um, the song is called Psycho, here it is. Yeah, um, guys, yeah, um, what can I say? It's such a sick song, right? Like, I'm not, I wasn't a big fan. Like the other ones, I got hyped for. But the fact that I'm still playing this song now, and it came out like in the beginning of the year, just shows you like it's it's a sick song. Like it's a mellow song. It's cool. Everybody loves it. 
So it had to be, it had to be number two. It was just above taste. But now the moment we've all been waiting for. What is number one? Like a light, like a light, yeah. like a light, like a light. I'm actually gonna let this one play because I love it so much. <laughs> so here it is, my number one, sicko mode. Woo! Hey, this here with all the ice on in the booth at the gate outside. When they pull up, they give me loose. Yeah, jump out, boys. That's Nike boys hopping our coat. Guys, this is the sickest <laughs> song of the year by so far. It is the coolest song. Of the year, it's when I heard it, I couldn't believe it. And the music video is the sickest music video ever invented, ever made. Actually. Um, they're so, it's so sick. Like, I don't know if you guys know even, but apparently, like, because you know, if, if you heard the song, which is shit by now, if you haven't, then leave this channel now. After you subscribe, by the way, subscribe down below. Um, Apparently, all the, the sudden changes in the song is supposed to represent a roller coaster. When I heard that, I was like, Mind blown. But I hope you enjoyed this, guys. I'm going to actually go listen to Sicko Mode right now because I'm feeling it. But um, leave a like. Subscribe down below, guys. And I'll see you all soon. Woo!